Peter, what took you so long? I had to get some supplies. If we're doing a stakeout, we need backup snacks. <laughs> Since when did this become a stakeout? I thought we were just gonna knock on a few doors. Yeah, we're gonna knock on some doors, but what if nobody answers? Do we just leave? No, we stick around and we see what transpires. Well, that seems illegal. Judy, it's not illegal just to wait outside someone's house for them. I don't know. It seems weird to me, Peter. Judy, look, you're looking for your mom. Just focus on that. And I'll worry about security like we talked about. You're right. So who's first? Well, E. Jenkins didn't answer the phone yesterday when I called, so let's start there. Okay. And there's four to do today total, right? That's right. Oh, Peter! Peter, what are you doing? Just see if your mom's in there. Knock on the door. Well, but, uh, what? Well, what are you doing down there? I'm hiding, so no one can see me. Why? I don't want to compromise the mission. <sighs> if anything strange happens, I'll jump out and protect you. Just knock on the door. Hello, young lady. How can I help you? I'm looking for Pam Jenkins. Does she live here? No, ma'am. There's no Pam here. Oh. Okay. Is that it? Are you sure she doesn't live here? Sure, <laughs> the day I was born. Well, do you know where she might live? I have no idea, young lady. I'm sorry I can't be of any more help. Okay. Thank you. Good luck. No one's home. Don't you think it's strange that Jake Jenkins and Ted Jenkins live right across the street from each other? Mm, no, not really. Isn't it suspicious that they're both not home at the same time? I can't think of any reason why that would be suspicious. Maybe they're family members. They live across the street from each other. That's strange. When I finally move, I'm going to move so far away from my grandmother. Mm, I would probably live near my dad. That's strange. Are you sure they weren't home? I was hiding, so I couldn't check. I'm positive, Peter. Mm. Oh, Judy, it's go time! What? Wait, what? Hold up, Peter! filming me. Put that camera away. Oh, hi, are you Jake Jenkins? Depends on who's asking. Put the camera away, boy. Turn the camera off, Peter. You heard her. Put the damn thing away. I'm sorry, Mr. Jenkins. Please ignore Peter. I'm looking for Pam Jenkins. Do you know her? I ain't telling you nothing until he turns the camera off. I'm going to call the cops. No, please don't do that. I am just looking for my mother, Pam Jenkins. Do you know what happened to her? Do you know if she lives across the street? Listen to me. I don't know no damn Pam Jenkins. You best not mess with my parents across the street. All right, turn the camera off before I turn it off for you. Judy, run. Oh, thank you for your time. Seriously? What? He was being very aggressive. I was protecting you. No, you provoked him. And then you refused to listen to his request to turn off your camera. Judy, you know I can't, just can't stop shooting footage for my video blog. Yes, you can. And you should have. 
Peter, you ruined everything. I didn't ruin anything. He didn't even know who Pam Jenkins was. He could have been lying. Judy, how can you tell if someone's lying unless they say something like the sky isn't blue? I can't control if he was lying or not. Look, I know you're very upset right now, but when you look back on this, you'll see that I was just protecting you. He could have hit you. No, Peter, that doesn't make any sense. Violence doesn't make sense, Judy. I was protecting you. Fine. Look, Judy, I'm sorry, but I was just trying to help. Try a little harder, okay? Aren't you gonna hide? Uh, yeah, I guess so. 